Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our 82nd World Championship of Public Speaking, the largest speech contest the world has ever seen. Each year, 30,000 Toastmasters among the 358,000 members in more than 16,800 clubs in 143 countries compete for the title. For those who are having a siesta now, listen, we're talking about money here. It is that magical moment, not your siesta, the contest, where people from different races, cultures, and backgrounds come together for the love of public speaking as a bridge to understanding, acceptance, and unity. It is the very contest that proves to the world that there is unity in diversity. Each contestant had fine-tuned, polished, and perfected their best speech from content, grammar, gestures, organization, style, and to everything in between. They had to go through the eye of the needle just to be on the world stage. They competed through the club, district, division, okay, through the club, area, district, division, quarterfinals, semifinal rounds. It is a six month long elimination. In the finals, however, each contestant had to completely deliver a new speech with just one day and a half in between the semifinals and the finals, the 10 finalists had to really change gear, reboot, and stay focused for their new world-winning piece. The winner for this year's contest has got everything to bring home the bacon. This speaker tickled us to the bones, make us ponder and wonder and inspired everyone's hearts, even those that are made of stone. Not only that, the speaker has also shown the world stage for the very first time that change, action, and entertainment can coexist in just one speech. The speech that moves us. The speech that challenges us to create change. The speech that provides us ways to be that change. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's give it up for that speaker who survived through it all and outperformed 29,999 contestants, the 2020 World Champion of Public Speaking, Martin Luther King Jr. Congratulations. Fantastic.